everyone, and welcome to the Sandbox stream with me, Panda Pops, joined with me in body and colour and face and spirit and voice is Lucas! Just me. I'm Lucas. You are Lucas. Mm. Some people tell me I'm not, but you know what? I don't believe them. No, never, never believe people that tell you you are not Lucas, because trust me, chat, you are Lucas. Wait, the chat's Lucas or I'm Lucas? Both. I oh, see now I'm wildly confused. Don't worry. Don't, don't think too much about it. I'm, I'm not going to be able to stop thinking about it. We might want to get into it because I am now miles away. Let's do this. Well, you are <laughs> Lucas. <laughs> and by you being here, it also makes chat Lucas, because everybody should aspire to be Lucas. Mm, kind of like that I am Negan stuff. Got it. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. we got okay. our first time chat. I've picked that up from you. That mm-hmm. 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 That is something I have picked up from you. <laughs> and I have noticed. It's like um <laughs> Joe with literally. He says literally literally all of the time is like it is literally the best game ever this is literally the worst thing i've played chat <laughs> there's like little things that people do around me loads and i like end up accidentally adopting them and i'm like damn it that's not me yeah you're welcome by thank, the way. You, thank you, you you're, thank you thank you you're welcome Thanks. my wife says she says yish yish instead of yes yish, yish. Ish. And I think it's adorable. And every once in a while, it just pops out and people are like, what did you just say? And I'm like, you know what? <laughs> you know exactly what I said. Let's just move along. <laughs> Nothing to see here, people. Nothing to see. Nothing at all. Except for the Lionsgate experience, which... Yeah. Hellboy. Hellboy. You know. Yeah. Hellboy. I, I, was dis <laughs> I was disappointed that I didn't get Hellboy because here's my favorite. Mm. But I did get a, a second best avatar, I think. I don't know Go who. Go on. I, I've got a I've got to pop him on so you can see him. Mm -hmm. There we go. Can you tell who it is yet? Oh yes, going slightly invisible. I might need to set up your stuff a bit better. <laughs> Lucas isn't really here. <laughs> I'm the ghost of Lucas Pass. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I think I think that might be better. I mean, yeah, here your screen behind you is a little bit fuzzy, but I think I'd rather have a fuzzy fuzzy behind than um a disappearing Lucas. I said what I said. Let's not think too much into it. I think Panda's a furry. <laughs> um, but yeah, Major Ben. Major Ben. Major Ben. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, Sam Zeus is in the chat. Did you guys know that Sam Zeus also streams and makes he does. the best assets I have ever seen in my life? They're just fantastic. They're, they're amazing. His assets are, I don't want to say second to none because there's a lot of talented <laughs> people out there, but I've never seen anybody make large scale assets quite like him it's but hyper realistic hyper realistic yeah. yeah incredibly beyond talented and the cool thing is is, uh, is me and zeus work together uh and i've seen his process for a number of the things that he's done and it's such a loving and painstaking process for him like he plans things out in advance like i don't know what other artist process processes are he's literally my one frame of reference he's the one artist i've watched actually work for multiple hours from the beginning like before he starts developing an asset like the planning phases but his planning phase is so incredibly long like i've seen him sketch things out and he involves math and it's just it's wild it's really cool there's a lot of love and effort that goes into it with him, and it's it shows with the final product. It really does. His assets are... I love watching his process. If if anybody wants to learn how to be a friggin' amazing master voxel artist, you need to watch Sansus because... Mm. Yeah. In fact... Solid advice right there. Are we able to do a shout-out? Shout there we go. I think that's right. Oh, Nice! How'd you do that? 
What was... witchery is this? <laughs> Magic! Woo! Magic! I'm a ghost, you're a witch. I mean, this is a, turning out to be a really fun stream. Uh, honestly, yeah. At least yeah. for me. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. We, who knows what's going to happen next? Except for me, because I've got the plan of what we're doing. Yeah, um, I they painted us. Yeah, a little bit. So we're going to be playing a new experience that has appeared on the map. We're going to play a featured experience um, that is featured on the map in the experiences page. And we're going to play an Ooh. events experience, which uh, is okay. going to be uh, Hellboy because, you know, uh, Avatar. Hellboy. Uh, and also I haven't gained any EP and uh, mm. I want to I wanna earn some sand. And you guys should want to earn some sand too. Like, mm. come on, get down with mm. it and boogie. Mm. I mean, who doesn't like to boogie? Exactly. Monsters, that's who. I think monsters like to boogie. There's the monster mash out after all. There is the monster mash. You're 100% correct. <laughs> you are 100% correct. I, I can't believe I forgot about that. I feel apologies to all the monsters <laughs> out there. Um, also, I have noticed, I don't know when this appeared, but in the experiences page, there are top themes that we can Ooh. see now. So they've got a whole theme. that a little? Sure. Uh, so top themes, art, culture, entertainment, fashion, luxury, gaming, lifestyle, music, NFT collections, and sport. I'm going to have a look at art. What are the top? So the Baby Yours experience, Lori G's NFT art gallery. Lori G in the chat and on here. Lori G. Maybe we need to go look at this NFT gallery. Is Lori G going to start big dogging us? Like... She could get famous and just take off and then never come to the chat again. Maybe. I'm going to go into not. the experience. Well, actually, yeah, no. No, you stay here. I demand it. Of everybody she that watches of these streams, I, I demand you stay for the stream. It has been demanded. Mm. Also, if you are watching over on YouTube when we re-upload these streams, do tune in to our actual Twitch streams because you can earn channel points. And do you know what points mean? Points mean... Prizes in the form of NFTs. Oh, okay. But say, are you gonna like show up at our house on Boxing Day and be like, <laughs> "Here you go, Unbox more things to unbox." Hey, no part of like a panda pops party. I like, like a panda, panda pops party. party. Whoop, whoop, whoop. I don't know whoop, if you heard whoop. that. <laughs> I cannot hear it. I, I am forever in this dome of silence as far oh. as all the alerts are concerned. No, it's okay. I have a way to combat said dome of silence. Ah, they, uh, Lori G says it's a work in progress. Emotional I heard that. <laughs> oh, so Lori G says this is a work in progress. They uploaded it to have an experience for the Builders Challenge. Well, nice. because you are here in chat almost constantly, and we adore you, regardless mm -hmm. of whether it's finished or not, we're gonna, I'm jumping into it. And I'm mm -hmm. uh, hopefully you've got a quest so I can do your quest and give you some sand for the Builders Challenge, basically. Everybody go, mm. look, it's a multiplayer. Let's all meet in Lori G's experience. I like how this is shaping up. Yeah. Oh, an active quest include a quiz about Van Gogh. I don't think I'm going to do well with this. Hey, Ninja Puppy Inbox. Also, I won't ever show up at people's houses on Boxing Day because that is my birthday. Mm. Oh, look at this. Oh, this is one of the Frenches, one of Andy Rich's collections. Oh, there's a couple Friend of Frenches. Cheese. French. Oh, pretty. Painting information, Vincent van Gogh portrait of the artist's mother. Right. Hello, Steve. There's Jason over there. Welcome to Lori G's NFT art gallery. We're thrilled to have you here to explore our Van Gogh exhibit. Uh, exhibit. Apparently, I can't talk anymore. Uh, the paintings are not loading. I have seen that happen on a few um, experiences, and that should be being fixed in 0 0.10. Go West, you're not getting it. And notifications when I stream? That is rude! Fix it. Just when, have, when, have when, mobile when, updates. Like, why, why are you not putting me in your actual Google Calendar? That's a good question. Mm. 
But my other question is this. Is it when Panda Pop streams for the sandbox or when Panda Pops yeah. streams for Panda Pops? In that case, then, yeah, you ain't getting notifications because I haven't streamed in like a mm. week and a half. <laughs> We also have a DM Archer watching us over on Twitter. Ooh. The ah. DM is a homie, if I if I will. Uh, very talented voxel artist who has created one of my, if not my all-time favorite asset in the sandbox. And that is my giant robot. Kind of kind of has a little bit of a Gundam feel to it, and it is stunningly beautiful. We often use it in experiences to to gauge how large or small something is because it's gigantic. This is trippy. I'm digging the wall. Ah, I fell. So my one feedback for this is because you basically have to get up there, pull a lever to go up to the next section. You want to check. You want a checkpoint. So, you, so if people fall on the next level, they're not going all the way back to the beginning again. And why can I not jump? Seems like a skirt. I've got to put my panda shoes on. Ooh. Go West brings up a very good point. He says, Panda, here to clarify the wheel spin channel points for Lucas. Is Ooh. that is that an actual wheel that you're spinning? Yes. Or is that a asset of a wheel spinner that would be <laughs> like, like so much confusion? It's, much confusion, very I keep forgetting confused. that I need to sync with you and Alex over this. Um, I believe you both have access to the sheet of um, allowed NFTs. Um, basically, the, the the NFT wheel spin is it is an actual wheel spin. Okay, there's a really right. long cooldown on it, um, and how it's gone the past couple of times is you're basically risking your points for potentially a lower channel point prizes or a really high channel point prize. So the last one we did, there was a Panda Pop's head. Oak Staff, Panda Pop's Head, Oak Staff, and then um, a Shibuya 109 Avatar, Oak Staff, another high uh, NFT, Panda Pop's Avatar, and then another Panda Pop's Head. So there's a couple of like like 10, 10k channel points prizes in there, but there's some 100k channel point prizes in there. So mm. you, you... How much is it for this wheel spin again? Uh, yes. Ah! Yes. Uh, I believe it's it was 30 for the first one. Um somebody spent it almost straight away, so I was like, oh, it's too cheap. So I increased it to 40. Chat said that was too expensive, but then someone redeemed it, which means mm. now it stays at 40 for at least two weeks. I was gonna say I see it for 40 right now. I feel like that's I feel like that's a good area to leave it at. You gotta get, you gotta risk it for the biscuit. You, you I mean, do. If there if there's no risk, there's no real reward. So exactly. I like it. I like it. Thank you, Go West, for reminding we about that because I had forgotten about the the wheel spin and ah! I would have been confused again. Came come future streams. Oh, did that get redeemed on on one of the streams? No, it just oh, got okay. brought up. Oh, and I okay. I was wildly confused. We You're were like, to what is this? <laughs> somebody actually sent us a link to an asset that somebody created. It's actually like a spinning wheel. Oh, and yeah. And I was like, oh, is it this or is it... I think there's a number of things that it could possibly be. Also, I really like the, the fact that the platforms are, are paintings in yeah. the museum. It's a nice little little extra like immersion it makes sense instead of it just being a a normal platform you're just like oh yeah paintings no oh, oh i don't know how i did that but i'm happy i did ah mm. this is hard mm. you need checkpoints in this i'm just i'm just saying it right now 
Also, maybe when you jump on these paintings, a little thing pops up that, you know, gives you the option to investigate the NFT. Like, what is it? Give a little description. Distract people. Throw them off their game. They're like, I want to learn about Van Gogh. They click on that button and all of a sudden they get smashed onto the floor. Ah! Oh, I got smashed onto the floor. I'm all the way back over here. Laurie G, you're going to make me very angry with this game soon. <laughs> It's very good. Well done. <laughs> Lori G says she needs to go attend a meeting right now. So. Oh, that, that's because they know I'm going to get angry and they're like, how can I, how can I avoid getting the wrath of Panda? The wrath of Panda is a very real thing. Yeah. Should it's be actually scared. a documentary about that on HBO Max if anybody wants to check it out. Although some scenes um, are exaggerated for entertainment purposes, I promise. If they wouldn't, if they weren't, they wouldn't be entertaining. Yeah, gotta Hollywood made her. They were like, "Hey, <laughs> we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna throw a dragon in here," and she's like, "What? There was no dragon in my life." And they're like, "Well, there is now for entertainment purposes." And I was okay with that. It's when they <laughs> um, they added the weird um, teleportation. Um... Oh, for Accident. fuck's sake! Yeah accident yeah the accident that happened mm. that's how panda got her furry behind <laughs> i'm so glad that that's been remembered full circle full circle <laughs> ah, no 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 oh you little bar stool I would like to remind you that we, we do have some Hellboy to play as well. We do. Um, and I do need to do a, a quest on here. Oh, if I do forward slash respawn, it brings me back here. Laurie G, I'm going to... I don't know if you're still here, but I'm going to have to come back and revisit this experience because apparently I'm not going to get to the end of it because I suck. Well, I mean, to be fair, you, you just don't want to step on the art. You've been trained your whole life. You know, you gotta stay yeah. at least a good four or five feet away from the art so you don't like breathe on it and ruin it with your human oils and whatnot. That's so very, you're just very to be true. respectful. You're just trying to be respectful. That's all that is. Okay. So we're gonna do we're gonna do the next one. Now, this is a multiplayer experience. I am going to need somebody to load in with me. So this is Silent Planet. If you mm. beat me, you will get an NFT. Say more right now. I mean, it's a multiplayer. First to the top wins. So no, I mean, like what NFT? Oh, um, uh, a panda head of their choosing. Dealer's choice. I'm into it. Yeah, I really need to make more panda heads. Okay. Yeah. Can we it's... expect that on a future stream? Yes. Yes, we can. And is there a theme for the panda heads that you're working? with or towards they're all heads in a jar that are lights they're he jar head lights panda those words all together okay so if you were to put that into ai and say hey help me create heads obviously it would have enough information to work with probably oh why did that crash interesting very interesting Ooh, would you want to point post a link for the experience in the chat? Oh, yes. That is smart. Smart, smart. Sm smart. Smart, smart. Here we go. It's called Silent Planet. Is it spooky? What do I get if I win? That's the question. Who wants to compete now? I get your Ooh. seed phrase. No, that is a joke. I will never ask you for that. <laughs> She won't do it. No. Don't right. give it. Right. I am here. It needs one more player, just so people can see. Um, no, I I get the glory of beating you live on stream. Now, don't mm. wouldn't you rather beat me on stream and take me down a peg or two? I, f I feel like that's something you guys should be aiming to do. Oh, we got Go West in here. Hey, Go West. Right. Come on, then. I'm green. 
I mean, if somebody beats Panda on stream, I'm just going to throw this out there. Clip. <laughs> clip, clip. That's all. Uh, oh. Yeah, you get, you get rewarded with NFT, but also eternal glory. Yeah. Oh, Crocodile Nyan over on X says hello. Hello to anybody and everybody watching on X slash Twitter. Go West, you need to pick up the little orange thing to play against me. You got to pick up the battery. Pick up the little battery like I did. I Wait, can't afford... you have to? Yeah, to play. Wow. Yeah. Uh, but anybody so watching the... on... Oh, sorry, you go. I was going to say the robot won't... doesn't have power without battery. Yeah. Wait, it's called Silent Planet. It's his head looks like a speaker. Yeah. So is it is it really Damn silent it. or is this like It's like musical chairs. Why can I oh. not jump? Because you need to get good. Push the forward slash, backslash. Yeah, I did make, now. Make faster. Oh. So you can see those musical notes coming out and if you have the yeah, audio yeah. it on. Oh. If you move when no music's playing. I don't know where he is. Oh, he's all the way over there. If you What's move, the little... then you get sent back to the beginning. Oh. Okay. What's the little thing you were just in? Does that recharge your battery? No, that makes the other player's platforms go small. 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 Jump is What's broken. So small? Oh, go west. Uh, cr crouch and then uh, do C. I think Panda hacked the server. I did turned not. Turned off your jump. Back on all this server talk again. I'm on to you, Panda. Ah! Damn it, I knew that was going to happen. Hmm, what happened? I, I moved. <laughs> oh, you cheated. That's why the game is saying don't cheat. Got it. Yeah. Oh, that's what you do for your next head. It's Hacker Panda head. There's like little circuit boards floating in there with you. It looks like Go West is struggling to get out of the entry gate. I, I want to say get good, but if it's a game glitch, I don't want to be mean. No, 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 get good. Come on, Go West. Oh. Mm, 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 and they're back. Do oh, they're stuck in a time loop. Oh. Well, let me just win, and then maybe we can start again. Once I get to the top, we won't count this. Someone took the other battery. I took the other battery. Wait, so you took two batteries? No, That's I took one. Selfish. Oh, somebody else is playing. I'm playing against someone else. I see people up there. Mm. Hey, okay. I didn't move. You're a liar. I was so close <laughs> to the top. <laughs> Music, go. There we go. So this game has... I almost want to say some Tron-y vibes to it. I, I kind of dig that. Oh. It's like red versus blue. Yes. Instead of blue, it's like neon green versus orangey. Oh. I see people up there. I see Go West up there. Oh, that was quick. Extreme Arcader says they're the one playing with Panda. Oh. They also Get said, good. I'm the captain now, so I don't know what that means, but I think Get that means good. they're winning. They're not. <laughs> I can see oh, one person can... over there. You can't get out they of the can't... start. Yeah. Interesting. They're just getting snapped right back to the start. Yeah, I'm seeing that. I'm wondering whether you move too much and now it's got you in an infinite loop. But we'll see, because... No! I didn't move, you're a liar. Maybe it's because you're moving up and down on the platform. It shouldn't be, but well... I know it shouldn't be, Maybe, but maybe because you're on a moving surface, it's still registering you as so displacing. This, this was... May, maybe that is the case, but this was a Game Jam entry for the Bumpkus Game Jam, I believe. Maybe. Mm -hmm. um, I'm not 100% sure. But it was an entry, and... There wasn't... See, I'm moving on that platform and it's fine. There wasn't that issue last time. Before, yeah. yeah. 
I just need to get to the end. Oh, oh I might get spawned back there. No? Okay, good. Can you also, I'm assuming when the the notes are playing from your head, there's also music playing in the game? Yes, there is. Okay. I gotcha. won! There we go! I did it! Completed it! Whoop, whoop! <laughs> and that should have spawned us all over here. And, uh... I can't play. <laughs> have, have two people already started? Let's go! It didn't re- Oh! Oh, okay. I accidentally picked it up. Accidentally, she says. Oh, are they able to get out now? You're moving while the music isn't playing. The music plays and stops at the same time for everyone. But yeah, don't move, don't move! Now move! Don't move! Stop moving! I'm definitely not laughing. Move! Stop moving! Oh, I fell. Yay! She fell. I did. Look, just move when I move, okay? Now move. Stream Arcader says it shows don't cheat even when the music stops. So question mark, question mark, question mark. It says so it says don't cheat when the music stops because if you're moving, you're cheating. You should move when the music is playing. Like musical chairs. You sit down and and be or musical statues. You stand still. When the music stops. So, fun fact, when I was a kid, I was uh, basically told I wasn't allowed to play musical chairs anymore because when the music would stop, or this happened one time, the music stopped and I kicked a bunch of chairs out from under people. <laughs> That's so mean. But they missed their chairs and the music was over and they weren't sitting in one. So I was like, my mind, it was like, well, they're not in a chair, so they lose. But, you know, the kid whose mom's birthday party it was, I, she didn't agree. I so. won't. Go west, grab it. No, of a person. No, naughty. <laughs> Did they? I think there's there's two on that team now. Well done. You somehow managed to break it. No, it's me against two. I mean, maybe it's just the system registering the talent that you possess. <laughs> and it's like, you know what? Let's give them a shot. Yeah. Put two on the other team. But I wonder if one of them gets fouled out, will the other get fouled out as well? Or will it be an individual thing? Hmm. Unsure. Hmm. Oh. Curiosa and Curiosa. Oh. What does that do again? The little it makes shield a, thing? it makes some small like you see my platforms. Oh, that's so cool! Yeah, yeah, it is. Oh man, that would make me so angry. Yeah, I'd be like, I'm not, I'm not moving. Those things are tiny. I'm, I'm not moving. I'm gonna wait for them to get big again. <laughs> oh no i moved i was gonna say what happens if you're on one of them like let's say you're on the edge of one and it gets smaller oh yeah evil yeah i know it's so great uh da i think go west is gonna win this they're up there i can see them Go west! Stand in the middle of the battery! He, he's already, pick it up! He says he won. He's already there. Oh. He already won. 
Well, GG's. Sure. Dealer's choice. Well, I saw you up there. I just don't know why it didn't finish the game. Because it wants you to keep playing. Oh. It's like, hey, game's not done yet. Keep going. Best out of 10. Oh, no. <laughs> no. No, no, no. Oh. I know we're doing... Oh, one second, actually. I want to check something out real quick. Oh, go west! You gotta pick up that battery or I'm winning! I'm not counting mm. it as a win until you get the battery. Hashtag mm. just saying. Mm. Go west, go pick it up. I'm giving you a chance. I thought he already won. Ah, I fell! Go west, pick up the battery! <laughs> I would say for this, it probably needs, like, an option to have more than... It says you won, but it won't let you pick it up. Oh, okay, maybe it's because we accidentally broke it by getting too many people on here. Because really, mm. it's just, like, 1v1. How do you regulate a multiplayer game to make it so that it's only 1v1? Well, that was the thing. You're meant to pick up the battery... Um, and both go west, and, and uh, sorry, I forgot their name, but they picked it up at the exact same time. So I think that's how, that's how they got away with it. Okay. Damn! Mm -hmm. Hey, Panda. Yeah? Are we going to do some, sort of, some form of a giveaway today, maybe? You want to know if there's a form? No, I already have a form made. I'm just wondering what I should put into it. A giveaway! Cool. You can do that. Yeah. Um, that I'm doing real bad now. Uh, Panda Normal Head. Normal Head. Got normal it. Normal Head. It's oh, we're Normal gonna be... Panda Head in the jar, correct? Yes. I didn't move! I think that platform going up and down does affect it a little bit. I think if it's going all the way down to all the way up, it's, it is uh, making it... It's hard? It is hard, isn't it? It's fun. I like it. I like it. I had a lot of fun... Uh, what was the game we played the other day? It was like Color, color catch, catch or... Yeah, Color Catch. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I had a lot of fun with the group play for Color Catch. It's really funny because Thursdays I, I go to a, a rehab and uh, my doctor, I didn't know this, but apparently he follows me on Instagram and he was just like asking me all these questions about it. He's like, so I saw that video you posted on Instagram. <laughs> like... What was, what was the deal with that? It looked like a lot of fun. And I was Aww. like, wait, what? <laughs> he was just like, yeah, you were like hanging out with your friends online and you, there was a really brightly Rainbow Road style game and you guys were bouncing around laughing, looking like you were having a great time. Like, tell me more about that game. I was just like, I'll happily tell you about the sandbox. <laughs> and so I was telling him all about it. And he was like, I think my, I think my kids are into that. Just like, oh my god, this is this is a this is a bonding moment, my dude. This is a bonding moment. I'm really happy we had today. Aw, that's so lovely. Yeah, it really was. Did I make them fall? I don't know. I don't think I did. I don't know where they are. Where did you go, extreme? If that's you, if it's here. Uh, they are hanging out in the corner crying. Because I made the platform small. So ah, hard. they fell. I don't know if they fell or not. I I'm love that you can like affect the other players like that. Kind of reminds me of uh, Canistry Run. Mm. Like the, the little mini game you play when you get booted off the level. Yeah, make everybody's like vision go weird and stuff. That's so cool. Yeah. That's such a I love that little mini game. Boo! 
room. I made us finish. There we go. And it says you won, Panda. I did. Go West gets no, no. Go West gets surprised. They definitely won. Um, but that's that's amazing. That was good. I like that. This is a really good game. Obviously, yeah. the o the current only downside is it is only two people can play. If yeah. If the person who created this, which um, I think we can see, it's by Yuri YBX. Um, if you are watching, and I think I actually put this in my feedback, having a different area for other people to either go to to hang out or just a, a multiplayer area that they could go to uh, for more people to take part uh, to do stuff would be would be great. Because you've got, advantageous. you've got loads of room here. Like, you could make it where there's maybe... Oh, did I, I... I accidentally froze this. This has happened numerous times to me when I've gone to click into chat and then it, it freezes my character. Uh, but there's loads of room here that you could probably do this, like, as a four-player experience um, with two going the other way as well, because this is only taking up, like, half of the map, but it kind of looks like I could be wrong. Uh, but you could make it so it's a minimum of two, and a, like, a 20-second countdown timer starts once two players have entered. So you could, you could do that. You're the one that's dancing. I wish I could dance, but I can't, because I am frozen. And you I can cannot... If you want to. I know. You can leave your friends behind. If I can't dance. Yep. That's now singing in my head. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, extreme um, slash sh sure, Joe. Thank you for playing. Go West. You, you obviously won this. GG's. Um, I would play another round if I wasn't frozen. Go Wes, I assume your wallet address is the same as all the other times that you have won things. Um, <laughs> let me know if it's different, I guess, and just put in chat, which head would you like? Or would Ooh, you like to be the- a cyborg head. <laughs> well, well yeah. currently there's only two. However, I was going to say, yeah. or you can have first dibs on the next head. You can have first dibs on whatever the next head is that I create. I, I'm saying you should make up in the future there should be a cyborg head, like cyborg yeah. panda head. He wants first dibs on the next head. Noted. Noted. Nice. Yeah. Ikeon's here. Hey, Ikeon. How did I miss that? Hey, friend. All right, we might come back to this game and do another one on here, but lots of fun like this. It's by Yuri YBX. I don't know if I'm saying that name right. I don't know whether I say any of the names right. Ah. Yuri Bix. Yuri Bix. That's it's like Weetabix. Like Superman villain. Oh. What, what was that? I, I was going to say kind of like Weetabix, but Yuri Bix. I have no idea what that is. You don't know what Weetabix say... is? No, I don't. Oh, is that a British thing? Okay. Pull it up on screen. But I was going to say, it reminds me of that Superman villain, Mixia Spitlick. I mean, we all know him. No yes. and love. Yes. This is Weetabix. Weetabix. Wow, it, it is spelled exactly <laughs> like you pronounced it. Weetabix, yeah. Is it cereal? Yes. Is it yes. hash browns? What is no. it? No, no, no. It's not hash browns. No. It's it's a compact, like a pressed slump of of wheat that you pour Sounds like delicious. <laughs> that you pour like milk over. Some people have like yogurt with it and and fruit. Um, or you just put like honey or sugar on it. It's nice. It's not Sounds shredded wheat. Shredded wheat is different. Weetabix and shredded wheat are both very, very different. Nanas knit shredded wheat. Nanas don't knit Weetabix. When you say knit. Knit. Have you not? I've got to show you that ad. I'll find it. But there was like a whole ad because 
Because shredded wheat kind of looks like it's been knitted together or woven. It does. It kind of looks like somebody yeah. crocheted it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, and so there was a whole like ad thing, like Nana's knitting wheat. Uh, not wheat, but sorry. Okay. Shredded wheat. Um, okay, okay. It's all coming together. I thought this was just another British term that like... I had no idea what you were talking. It was like when I, when you said it, I was like picturing an old lady just like knitting together food. <laughs> yeah, food. But yeah, that's exactly what you were saying. So I was spot on. Whew. And with Weetabix, huge huge arguments happen because some people like to heat if they have it with milk some people like to heat it up i for one okay. am not a heated weetabix fan i'm i'm not keen on it my kid however absolutely loved it loved his weetabix being heated up and i was just like i i don't know where you came from but you're wrong like i don't know where you came from but you need to go back there yeah no son of mine will have heated weetabix <laughs> this is a cold weetabix house and i exactly. will die on this hill 100 <laughs> percent that's that's how the conversations went so though no fair. lie that's totally fair reasonable definitely not monstrous in any way shape or form no no of course not mm -mm. uh so the next game that we're playing is uh mm -hmm. blonkus battles now i can't remember i think they came in the top 10 for the bonkers just, game jam it's very two. Thank you. Thank you for having the best memory ever. Welcome. Um, Sanzus wants you to say heated Weetabix ten times fast. That will not happen. <laughs> uh, but yeah, Blomkus Battles. I'm not going to play too much of it, but okay. we'll, we'll have a little look at it and we'll go over some things. Um, and hopefully you guys can go enjoy. And this is one that is on the featured section. So this is one of the experiences that Sandbox is like, we are featuring you because you are amazing and everybody should go play. And you should go play this. It's pretty damn good. In that voice, in yeah. that tone and tempo. Oh, 100%. Perfectly spot on. Mm -hmm. That's how Sandbox sounds. Like I have meetings <laughs> with Sandbox all the time. And that is how wow. Sandbox sounds. Lucky lady. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, maybe not, because that is how they sound at their voice, tempo, and volume every for everything they say. Um, so it might get a little confusing, considering you sound just like that as well. Oh, yeah, a little bit. People get as confused all the time. Inner dialogue just loses all meaning. Yeah, been there. Been there. No, my inner dialogue is quite quite interesting, because... That all, all my inner dialogues of me, but they all kind of sound a little bit different. So they're different me's. Do you mm. have that? Like that there's multiple 100%. voices? Yeah, good. I'm not alone. Perfect. There's three. Oh, I have. Yeah, sure. I only have three too. There's not a whole book filled of characters inside my head. It's like a round table. <laughs> have, you ever, have you ever watched Big Bang Theory? I know I talk about this all yeah, the time. I have, have I, ever, yeah. Okay. So the Council of Sheldons. <laughs> yeah. I'm I picturing mean, that, but the Council of Pandas. Kind of, but it's a little bit more chaotic than that, really. Like, okay. So it's more of a coliseum of pandas. A little bit. Yeah. Yeah. And, so, and some are more angry and some are, yeah, it's... So the coliseum works perfectly. <laughs> and eventually there's a fight to the death in the center between the two final pandas. Yeah. Okay. And whoever wins the fight wins the argument? Well, no, because usually, usually the argument is... Hmm... I can't explain this without sounding crazy. You can't. <laughs> Go for it anyway. Any arguments that I have, and I'm going to reference particularly ones that I have with my partner, I will do both sides of the arguments out loud. More, with more to, like, I'll do his side of the argument, but also in my head there's a couple of arguments mm -hmm. happening as well. And there will be an argument, compromise, and resolution, all without him saying a single word. It's a pre-argument argument. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're just planning for yeah. eventualities. Yeah. Everybody does that. To a degree. Yeah. All right. 
Let's go to the Bumpkiss Citadel. <laughs> Let's... The Citadel of Bumpkiss. What? Look Start up. splicing today. Uh huh. We're gonna go this way. And you are going. Honestly, this really deserved coming in second place because. The amount of, like, logic and game mechanics that this experience has implemented is beautiful. So much. So beautiful. Dr. Bunkus, you made it to the Blomkus Splicing Lab. Great. The Gen B Splicing Scientists have prepared you a strong Blomkus. It should grow strong quickly. Head over to the console over there to learn more about your Blomkus. Blomkus. Yeah. Learn about your Blomkus. Show Blomkus base stats and moveset. So, wow. Blomkus type, normal, move set, moves, headbutt, small attack up, small defense down. Great, you are all caught up. To prove yourself as a as an avatar, you need to, at the very least, prove you are better than the Gen Bs or the multi-metaversal portal will never respond to you. Okay. Not quite. I have uh, blah, blah, blah. So there's loads of stuff. Okay, we read it in your own time. We don't have time for that. <laughs> hey panda i got a question for you yes when would you like me to drop the uh, form for the giveaway um what oh wow wow um drop it in five minutes and then we'll close it. it after five minutes okay and then we'll have 20 minutes left because we're going to stream for an hour and a half apparently okay all right, so Drop it got... in five minutes. Yep. On the hour. You threw a lot of times at me. I got a little confused. Okay. So. Uh, on the hour. <laughs> because you're not, you. you're not a weird like half hour out from me. We're both on the hours. Wait, are there people that are half hour out from you? Yeah. Is that a thing? I think one country. I think it's a thing in one country. What country? What country? I can't remember, but I know it's, it is. Do they have a 24 hour day? Yeah. <laughs> Do. Okay. Whew. All right. Here comes here comes the fun. Okay. Great stuff. You made it to the desert wasteland. Your trials begin now. To be able to challenge the guardian in the temple, you must first retrieve two keys from the dungeons. Good luck to your Gen C one, and don't disappoint me. I'll become mm. the best. So you walk into the grass, and a wild blobcus appeared. <laughs> Choose an attack. I'm gonna go for a damage attack. Headbutt. Mm. Mm. Oh, he's gonna blump. Okay, they've only got they've only got 30 HP, so I'm just gonna attack them again. Okay, they're down to 20. And their their last attack only did one damage. Ooh, yeah, that one. Ooh, he cursed you. He did. He made Is my it a attack later. Yeah. So different Blomkus body parts all have different um, abilities. Yeah, me and Woke Zombie were talking about the, the coding and programming he did for this, and it is exhaustingly wild how oh. much he put into this. I mean, him and uh, Wayward, they just poured their heart and souls into this game, and it's overly abundantly clear and incredibly impressive. It's it is so impressive. I think one of my only feedbacks regarding this is, one, they needed a little bit more information about going to go and splice your Blomkus okay. because I got through almost to the very end before I even realized I could go and re-splice my Blomkus. I was I was using my, mm. my standard Blomkus for almost all of it. Um, okay. So a little bit like maybe after the desert where it's like, go back and like really in your face, reminding you to go and uh, splice. Um, and then the other feedback is I would have liked to have seen a little bit more story in between sections because it does as much as the co the coding is amazing and what they have done is beyond fantastic and i don't want that to be taken away from what i'm saying here um but okay. it is nice for an a game like this to have a little bit more like story and lore as to why 
like each level that you're going through instead of, hey, you did the desert area, let's go to the next area, do the same thing in that area, then go okay. to the next area and do the same thing there. Like a little bit more variety in terms of maybe there's a little story over this side that you get to develop a little bit or the character grows over here. Just just a little bit, just a little bit like that. Okay. I can definitely dig it. But this what, is amazing. What I'm hearing you say is you loved it and you wanted more. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, that's that's a it's a very sincere compliment coming from a gamer like Panda. Aw, thank you. Mm-hmm. Uh, no, usually the <laughs> experience like it. the experiences that I like the most will most likely have a lot more detailed feedback on how I would like to see it improve because I really liked the experience enough to care about it and be like, hey, to make this like the most amazing game ever and succeed loads, I'm going to give you all of this feedback on how I how I feel uh, compared to experiences that may not have done as well. They, they may get a little bit less passionate feedback. They still get feedback, hmm. but it might not be as passionate. My wife says the same thing. She says, you don't need to worry when I'm constantly coming to you, like her employees and whatnot. She tells them, you don't need to worry when I'm constantly coming to you with feedback for improvement. That's how you know I care. You need to worry when I'm not saying anything. Mm. Yes, yeah, it's very true. Mm. So we've already leveled up. I feel mm. like we leveled up quite quickly. I like it. You're just that good. Yeah. Pro, pro gamer. Pro gamer extreme. Yes. All right, a new, oh, a new Blomkus. And every new Blomkus we defeat gets added to our splicing area. And mm. I'm going to show the splicing area soon. I was going to say, can, when can we see that? Well, the splicing area is where we started, but I'll show you how we do splice. Mm. I want to see all the splicings. Oh, he's down. He's, he's a goner. Bye-bye. You suck. He has negative six HP. So you didn't just defeat him. You, like, stole potential energy from the future. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. Well done. Yeah. Well done. My Blonkus is the very best. I mean, he looks like the Stay Puft Marshmallow Rant Man's, like, compressed little brother, so I'm going to say yeah. I see VVox in the chat. Hey, VVox. Who else do I see in the chat? Julie Sancho. Extreme Arcade is still there. Hello, hello, hello. Ooh. Pickaxe master. Ooh. Fox. The question is, is Pickaxe master... Uh, you thought that was your phone vibrating? No, sorry, that was my phone vibrating. Uh, do you think Pickaxe think Master is a Pickaxe Master? I do believe so. Ah. Their, their knowledge of geology and pickaxes seems to be pretty profound. So I would say they do definitely have some real world experience. I don't know. I haven't heard them say that. But if I was to make an assumption, which I often do, <laughs> they are actually a group of miners oh. developing this game under the world in some sort of a bunker. Oh. I feel like that's just not really a big stretch of the imagination right there. No, I, I feel like that. That tracks. I feel like that. That mm -hmm. seems like it tracks. Thank you, uh, thank yeah. you. Now, oh my goodness. We do have geologists in the... Oh, they... That mm. is... There you go. See, you are correct. Mm. Knew it. So, not pickaxes, but axes. About a month ago, I chopped down my first ever tree with an actual mm. axe. Okay. And I was very proud of myself. I mean, you do have a couple trees on property that, that did look like they needed some pruning. Mm-hmm. That so, well, there was there was a I, it wasn't small, small, it was still pretty tall. Um, mm -hmm. but it was it, it's it wasn't too large. 
but it was right next, like behind the neighbor's garage and their oil tank. And I was like, this tree's got to come down because I don't it's want it to fall. Problems. Yeah, I don't want it to fall. There is another tree that does need to come down. It's much taller, like much, much taller. And I'm like, that needs a professional. I can't do that. I'm not doing that. It's Oh my God. So something... A very similar situation happened to me. Um, there's a, when I first moved into the place I'm at now. Uh, there was a out front. There was this gigantic. I don't know. Are you familiar with what a eucalyptus tree is? Yes, we have. I have one on the property. Okay, so they get to a certain size, and then oftentimes they fall over. One of my buddies, in, he's from Australia. He calls them widow makers because oh. branches fall off of them all the time, and like just clonk people on the head. Well. It was getting really big, and the person who lived here before us clearly didn't take care of it at all. And so I did called somebody up to like come out and take care of it because it was way too big. Not like get rid of it completely, but get rid of like 90% of it. Yeah. And one of my neighbors was parked on the street, like right next to it. I told her, I was like, hey, I don't think you should park there. It, it's July. We live in Arizona. Um, Strong winds come out of nowhere. Monsoons hit us out of nowhere. Like if that happens, I'm worried the tree's going to fall over and it's going to crush your car. And she very aggressively and very rudely told me not to tell her how to live her life and that she would do whatever she wanted on public property. And so I just said, okay, that's cool. Like I'm just trying to make sure your car don't go no squish. And uh, sure enough, later that night, we had a monsoon, oh. tree fell over, and her car was totaled. Oh, damn. So taking care of those trees before they can become an issue. I feel like that's really smart and kind of you, Panda. Yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm a kind, kind person. We're going to go into the splicing lab now. So we go over to these sections, and okay. uh, we can choose the next Blomkus parts. Now, we only see the ones that we have witnessed. And it will tell you what type it is. HP, stamina, speed, defense, attack, and like the cost of things. Um, and then obviously this is the cost of things. How much do you have to spend? Uh, so like the so their stamina cost. So when they have to do an attack, how much stamina? Oh, I see what you're has. saying. I yeah. see what you're saying. Okay. So, so does it cost you points in the here and now? No. It's talking about points when you're in the battlefield. Exactly. Gotcha. So we can, Ooh. and then the tank at the very end will show us what our Blomkus looks like. So this is now what our Blomkus looks like for battle. Yes, go west. Uh, the Blomkus Trial 6 reward has gone out. And one boxed is here. Hey, one boxed. And now we're in the coral wetlands. And uh, we basically do the same thing here. We battle. There is a definitely not Sonic option here. And go west. Unfortunately, we don't have that information here. Um, it just when it does is when it goes out. So we got stamina here. If we get right down to the, our, the lowest of our stamina then we do need to rest to get our stamina back up. But we're going to knock out definitely not Sonic. And now we can go back to the lab and we can now make ourselves look like definitely not Sonic. Definitely not Sonic? Uh-huh. But what, what if you want it to look like Sonic? I mean, I'll just do the head. Okay, are those arms and legs? Are those like crab arms and legs? Yes, they are. <sighs> Adorable. Oh, you don't always get their body parts. So I got the torso for definitely not Sonic. Mm. Um, so you have to battle them a couple of times to get all of the body parts. Okay, good to know. I forgot about that until now. Definitely there not we go. Sonic. Yeah. Because mm. Sanic didn't have a bow tie. No, he didn't. Hey, Yoda Labs. Hi. Over on X. Oh, did we give the form out to the people over at X? 
literally just now dropping it on both. Oh, good, good, good. Yes, I forgot. That's okay. We were chatting. We were, and you're you're too entertaining. Stop it. Okay. Stop being so entertaining, Panda. Hi everyone. I'm Panda Pops, Ooh, and welcome no, to the no. stream. I immediately regret everything <laughs> I've ever done. Uh, today we have been playing some uh, sandbox uh, games that they're kind of fun if you if you like games. Um, you should check them out. I guess maybe. I apologize. Please go back to previous. <laughs> <laughs> okay, if you say so, if you insist. Uh, yeah, so we have been playing <laughs> playing some sandbox games. We played Silent... Silent what? What Planet. did we play? Silent Planet. Thank you. We played Silent Planet. We may jump back mm. into that. And we have just been playing Blomkus Battles. Um, I do fully suggest you go check out Blomkus Battles. This is a single player game. Um, we can't go too much into it because it's going to take too much of our time. And I do also need to play one of the event games uh, because I want the EP. But Blomkus Battles, definitely go check that out. It is on our featured section on experiences. In fact, you know what? I'm just going to uh, put the link right there. And uh, do 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 do. Where where is it? There we go. So we're gonna be playing the um, hey, yeah. The link that you just dropped. Yeah. It after the exclamation point is broken. Oh. So is there a there's a shortened version of these? Correct. It's not broken when I Maybe. click it. Copy and paste. Yes, copy and paste does work. I think there's a way to do a shortened version of these. One second. Let's see. I mean, I could put it in, like, bit.ly and get a short link. Oh. But that might take a little bit too long. Yeah, don't worry about that. Um, I think I got it. Okay, thank you. Uh, but, yeah, we're going to play Action City, presented by Lionsgate. There's a 50k... Sand a prize pool only for he Hellboy avatar owners. I am a Hellboy avatar owner and I want to play this game. Um, so there we go. Ah, thank you, Go West. I really appreciate you. Go West is amazing. Did you yes. know Go West makes YouTube videos? <laughs> Tell us more right now. <laughs> go Say more right now. Go West makes YouTube videos about the sandbox, uh, all the amazing experiences within the sandbox, they play them, they make videos, and promote you guys who are building in the sandbox basically for free. Check out all of their videos because they're pretty damn cool and pretty helpful and we should all support creators in the sandbox. They are just go west on YouTube. You can find them. You can find them on uh, Twitter as well, slash X. I'm never going to call it X. I'm sorry. It is not X to me. It is just Twitter. I have to feel obligated to say x um but it's twitter okay you do you i will yeah yeah did i say you two or youtube youtube mm -hmm. but also you two is a pretty cool band right right are you asking for an honest opinion i'm asking for the opinion that aligns with mine <laughs> Which is... I don't know what your honest opinion is. What is your honest no, opinion of you? No, what YouTube? your opinion is. Oh, no, I do like you too. Okay, there we yeah. go. They're wonderful. <laughs> I mean, it's up to you if you like you two or not. I'm not that first. I do not. Oh, do you not? Okay. No, they're just not my cup of tea. Ah. Uh. Ah, uh, no, no. I was just messing about. I want to get back up. Thank you. Okay. Mm. Oh. Gatekeeper. Oh, Hiya, scarlet. welcome to the Action City. I do, don't I? Yeah, that sounds tail. exciting. Your favorite action movies are on the other side of the gate. Awesome. Mm. There's more to the story, but you have to discover it for yourself. Come on, give me an int. You'll see. But first, yes, yes, say more. No spoilers, get going while the going gets tough and see where the action is. Okay. Is that, is that how that phrase goes? Get going while the going gets tough? That is lyrics of a song. If you know Boyzone, the tough gets going. 
I'll I'll send you it. Don't worry. I'm not okay. gonna sing. Okay. Whew. Oh, oh, you're sliding. Ah, sliding, sliding. Down. What is oh, this? Those people fight. Oh, they're laughing. I thought they were fighting. Hellboy. Wow. Hellboy okay. with the horns. Oh. Hello. What are you doing, Miss? Do you need help, Miss? Miss? Do you need help? I mean, she looks very distressed, but there's also a kitty cat at the top, so. Oh my gosh, there maybe, is! Miss! Maybe they're just playing a game? Oh, I'll, I'll help you! Look, I'm, I'm on my way! Oh, I'm, I mean, you I'm... are a big cat. Meow. If anyone can climb that tree, you can. Meow! Meow! No, it's not working. Mm, that's too bad. Movie poster, Hitman's Bodyguard. Oh, I've seen that. Have you seen that? The Hitman's Bodyguard? I have. I have. Movie poster, Angel Has Fallen. Have I seen that? I don't think I have. Is it good? Um, I would like to go back to the Hitman's Bodyguard because anything with Ryan Reynolds is good. Oh, well, yes. Oh! He is, I want to say a national treasure, but that doesn't really do him justice. Like, what's the term for somebody who's a treasure for the whole world? Because that's what I would like to use in reference to Ryan Reynolds. A global treasure? I'm okay with that. Let's do that. Universal. I'm sure aliens love his, his work as well. Not if they've seen Green Lantern. You know what? I liked Green Lantern. I actually did as well. I don't know what all the issue was about it. I didn't it. Hate was it was a bad movie. That's what the issue was. But I liked it anyway. And I know I shouldn't have. Me and my best friend went to see it. And all these years later, he still gives me crap for it. He, like I'll be like, hey, you want to go see this movie? He'd be like, I don't know. Is it going to be any better than Green Lantern? <laughs> I'm like, dude, it's been 20 years, man. Give it a break. And he's like, I'm, I'm never going to let this go. You owe me 750 or whatever we paid for the movie. So, but yeah, anything, anything with Ryan Reynolds is enjoyable to watch. The man is a universal treasure. What oh, was the I other movie? Have... Um, Angel Fallen. Oh, I've never seen that one. No, me neither. I didn't pay attention to what I was reading. But also, look, this guy is chasing this person with a shopping cart. He's like, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Stop that, sir. Hey, one boxed is here. One boxed. You look like me. Stand still. Ooh, come back. <laughs> oh, I like his shirt more. You like your open drip shirt? So I much like cooler. his stance. His. <clears throat> yeah. We both do it. Military posy. Yeah. Yeah. He's at parade rest there, just looking, looking solid. I like to sit. Sit, boo boo, sit. Good boo boo. Um, sometimes like mad, mad. No, mad's normal. Clap, claps normal. Goodbye. Yes. Uh, talk. Face palm. It's normal. What's the, what's the jump like? Oh, yes. Oh. Like a ballet dancer. Da, 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 He's ready for Swan da, Lake. Da. Yeah. I don't know the music to Swan Lake. Right. What I was I either. meant to it's do? It's literally the only ballet term I am familiar with. Nutcracker. Is that ballet? Yeah. Oh, I thought that was like a musical. A kid's Fish. musical. Sure you learn something new every day. Whoa, look at that. Look at this. Yo. Oh, yes, please. Yo. Oh, what is happening? We are all going to be watching films in the sandbox at some point. I, I can't wait to watch movies in the sandbox with my homies. Oh. I'm not going to lie. That is something I've been looking forward to for a couple of years now. It's going to be so cool. Do you know oh. what I've been practicing? Doing my voiceovers for some of my characters for an experience. Okay. Give us a, give us a preview. Character no. A, go. Looks like you use all voice okay, stuff. Okay, character B, go. I love it. Character C, character C. 
<laughs> they have names. Um, I know, but I don't want to give away the names, mainly because I don't know what they are. But, but I don't still. know who Character C is. I guess uh, Character C Any could character? be... Oh, well, you know me, I just uh, never tipple it uh, old. Booze is going to be a party time for, for good old Benny here. B -b 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 Benny. Benny is a boozer. Benny is a big old booze hound. Um, he he left his his family to pursue a music career, um, and he's yeah. not that good of a musician. And he spends most of his time um, just drinking with the fairies. And I don't mean that as like he's away with the fairies kind of thing. I mean he's literally drinking with fairies. Like you mean like little sprites? Yeah. Little little, little angelic. Butterfly-like creatures. Oh, the ones in my experience aren't angelic little creatures. Some are rough and tumble. Well, I mean, they could be rough and tumble too. I'm just talking about appearance-wise. Like they they fly and they're tiny. They're not tiny. Oh well, then never mind. How do I get? Oh, I get over there here. Hello, one boxed. What is it? Oh, um, what, what's that movie that recently came out? Um, Tom Holland, Chris Pratt. Dungeons and Dragons inspired. Oh. Is it the animation one? The animated yeah. one? Oh, uh, something home where they have the... Onward. Uh, onward, yes. Yeah. Okay. Do you remember the fairies from that? They were like bikers. Yeah. <laughs> Those guys were cool. I, <laughs> who are you looking at? They were just like robbing a liquor store and whatnot, just like all casually stealing everything around them, beating up. They were they were wonderful. I liked Onward. That was a good film. That was a really good one. I once I mean, this is gonna surprise everyone in the chat if they know anything about me, but I'm a huge fan of Tom Holland and Chris Pratt and them together in that one. I definitely didn't get misty eyed towards the end. Oh, what's what's Betsy saying? My whisper not working, but Panda will have it for two other claims at the moment. I can send you in direct. Bert, just send me in direct chat, please. He redeemed Backpack of Tears, and oh. I wanted to add his info to your spreadsheet. Yes, please. Backpack of Tears. Uh... He's under heavy security at the Millennium Building. So will, so so will Banning surrender? Yes. Wait for wait for him here. Me, I have to go. Where do I have to go? Underground. I have to go underground. This look at this whole place. Look at it. Oh, it's like a movie set. Look, look, it's like a movie set. It's like a movie set. That's so cool. Oh, why are they cheering? Yay! Fire! Because they love you. Woo! Woo! Hmm. Or, the, or the fire. They're, they're, they're cheering the fire. Oh, look, he's on a scooter. Oh, hello. To hell with the password. Awesome. I'll purchase them all. Oh, okay. Yeah, purchase them, baby. Purchase them. Hmm? Purchase, what? purchase what? I don't know. He said okay. something about a password and purchasing them. So, mm. women? I just got dark. I don't think it is. It's a joke. It's a joke. I'm sorry. It was a bad joke. <laughs> right, maybe... Oh, wow, this place is beautiful! Look at it! Yeah, it really is. NFTs. I think he's purchasing all the NFTs. Hmm. Got it. What took me so long? I don't know, Michael Bryce. A dream. Great. I hate dreams about work. Well, you are you here to help me or what? Depends. Tell me what you need help with. I'll consider it. That's I, fair. I need you to get into the AAA rated bodyguard of the year awards party and ah, now I recognize you. Yeah, the disgrace AAA bodyguard. If 
That's a cover story because I'm undercover. That's why I need your help. Sure. I've always dreamed of going to... Oh, wait, no, it's a real... Sure. Sure. I've always dreamed of going to the Bodyguard Awards. Is that That's a real, a real thing? Show. Yeah. I mean... Yes. Yes, question mark? I don't know if it's called that, but... Is that actually a bodyguard thing? It's a private security thing, yeah. That's cool. And then do, like, rich people, like, bid on the best bodyguard to have? Like, and by bid, I mean pay salary money towards to have the best bodyguard? Like, do they get, like, a trophy? It Does it go on their CV? Like, hey, I won best bodyguard of the year. Like, now my fees have doubled. I... I have no follow-up. I had, I didn't, I don't actually know if this is a real thing. I was joking around. I didn't expect follow-up conversation or questions. <laughs> so I'm going to politely bow out of this and hopefully somebody else takes over for me. Is there a third person in this call? <laughs> no. Dang it. Where's Alex when you need him? Oh, hello. B, are you here? No. Okay, yeah, I, I have no follow-up. I don't know anything about this. That's fine. I, I was... It, it's, it's all good. Inside the box... You're asking great questions, though. Now I'm curious. Yeah. Inside the box, there is a word I probably shouldn't say on stream. There are three wires connected to the timer. A blue, a green, and a red one. Which one will I cut? Always cut the blue wire. That doesn't seem right. Okay, don't cut the blue wire. Always cut the red wire. I have prevented a tragedy! Yeah! Do it. Always cut the red wire. You, you sure about that? Because you, it, you went into this very, very willy nilly. <laughs> I'm, I'm like eighty two five percent sure. Eighty two five. So like yeah. eight hundred and twenty five or eighty two point five. Yes. Nice. Look at this. There's this so many cool, like, oh, look at that building down All there. All the little biomes. This is amazing. Oh, so pretty. <laughs> I want to make pretty things like this. That The front of that house is incredible. Yeah. The whole house is. The whole house, actually. I thought it was one of the, like, you were looking at it from the front, so I thought it was like one of those movie set houses. No, but no, that's a full house. Yeah. And you're inside of it and running around. That's beautiful. Can't jump through the window though, and the window's big enough for me to fit through. Make the window exitable. There's glass in there. They don't want you jumping out of it. It's like a hotel. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I can interact mm, with mm, the horse. Mm, 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 mm. No. I want to interact with the horse. It says interact, like but I can't yes. interact. But he's following you. He's not. Maybe that's the interaction. Like when you when you when you ran around him, he followed you around him. Corral. Wow. Yeah, I just realized. Corral. Yeah. Mm. You gather horses in coral and then you're going to have a big <laughs> problem on your hands. They're going to yeah. get all cut up. Oh, Alex is in the chat. Be happy. He said 82 plus 5. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Does somebody message Alex just being like, they need your help with something? <laughs> I'm I'm guessing that's that's how the wage goes up. It's it like their fee increases eighty two plus five. That seems legit. The math is mathing there. Mm, the, the mathiest math that yeah. have ever mathed. Yeah, one hundred percent. Find a spot to wave at them. They'll react to your movements. Well, they didn't earlier because I ran around your whole ranch. Seahorses. Yeah, that's what they are. They're seahorses. Ah, so obviously the men are pregnant. Got it. <laughs> it's better if several people the work together. Yeah, of course. But one can do it. I'll try. Okay, so I gotta find a spot to wave at them. Can I get on the roof? On the roof. Mm. Where am I getting them? In here. This is where they need to go. Can I open a gate? No. Oh, I just interact with him. I'm so disappointed. I really wanted to wave. I 
I'm sorry that you're sad about not getting to wave at the horses. <laughs> I just hope at some point today gets better. Mm, I think it will. I mean, it's almost <laughs> the end of the day. So, I, th I think yeah. so. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, do we have a winner? We can. We can have a winner? Do okay, yeah. chat, should we have a winner? Also, because Alex is here, I feel like I, I want to show off the new, because he wouldn't have seen it. There's a new There's a new emote. There's a hi Alex emote. And there's a, there's a get good emote. There's... <sighs> Uh, this is a tier two emote, but there's a Seb emote on tier two, and the tiers of enemies has moved down to tier one, and a panda <laughs> animated wave one. Amazing. But I do like the Alex one because he looks like he needs help. Wait. <laughs> what? Okay, I feel like that sounded so wrong. And so I'm going to quickly um, show everybody what I mean by that. <laughs> because that, sound, that sounded mean. Um, the mm -hmm. avatar, because he's small, you can't, you can't small. fully see. You can't fully see. Uh, but he looks like... Where's his avatar gone? I don't know. I know it's near here. Here it is. Right, so this this is this is the one, and you cannot tell me that that does not look like he's going like help, help me. Ah! Oh yeah, yeah, actually, ah! yeah. Now I pulled the screen back up. He yeah, he does look like he's a little distressed. Yeah, yeah. So that's why I like this one because it's really like a ah, help. It's like it's like. He is stuck with the kids and his wife has been away for a couple months. She's working and he's still working from home, but she's gone off on some work thing and his parents were there helping out, <laughs> but they had to go back home for whatever reason. So he's waving goodbye to them as they leave. And he just knows the second he walks back inside, it's just going to be screaming. See, I like your take on it because my take was, um, because the first time I saw this is when we were getting ready for Alpha Season 2 party stuff. And that's the first time I saw that. And I put his avatar in between me and Joe. As, and so to me, the story behind it is like, help, I'm stuck with these two crazy people. Mm, yeah, that works. That works too. Yeah. That works. All right, Rambo. Good. Now use the set traps around the yard. How do I do that, Rambo? I have made one already. You can copy it. Okay, right away. Yes, sir. Yes. I will copy what you have done. This is good for a barricade. Yes. Prepare for battle. Return to Rambo. I will. Ah. Thank you, my friend. It's my privilege, Mr. Rambo. Mm. Call me John. What can I do now, John? Go back to explore this strange land. I see floating in the sky. Will you be okay? Yes, but I might need your help again for something big. Just let me know. I'll be there, Mr. John Rambo. Back to the film. Gonna sit with my buddies. Right here. Right. When we do have proper cinemas in the sandbox, mm. we need better chair sittingness. Mm. I don't know if or when this will be possible, but the ability to have... Um, so I would say this would have to be on both ends. Like um, the game builder would have to do this, but to assign a chair a seat tag... And then when a player gets up to it, they can interact and just auto sit in the chair. I would love to have that. I want mm. that. Hey, Panda, I got a question for you. Yes. When Birdsey redeemed his points, he redeemed it for backpack of tears top up. What does the top up mean? It's just a joke. 
Oh, okay. Um, so it's a it's a backpack of tears, and all the tears inside of it are like top up jars for your jar of tears. Uh... So it's a it's a top up for your jar of tears, and we joked about it costing nine ninety nine subscription. Okay. But it doesn't cost anything, don't worry. I mean, yeah, I kind of figured. But still, thank you. Whee! I wish this one was slidey as well. Oh, are we in a fishmongers? Cod's oh, Wallop. Yeah. What a great name. Who came up with that? Cod's Wallop. What do you want? To see Hellboy? Yeah. You think you can just go in like that? Yeah. Yes, I go do. On. Yeah. Why, why not, is my answer. You will have to provide the password. Is it password? Nope. You have to do better. Okay. Hello. Will you tell me the password? Regular customer. You want to know the password? Yes. You know it? Maybe. But what do I get? Um, what do you want? Don't worry, I'm just hungry. Some fish and chips will do. Okay. Uh, miss! Where do I buy it? Fish and chips, please! Oh, thank you! Oh, they smell real good! Sir, can I have your fish and chips? I thought I gave him the fish and chips. I'm very annoyed. I have to do it again. <laughs> I'm Manovic asks if someone redeemed the random wheel NFT, do they get a random sandbox NFT? It the can answer be. is yes and no. It is random as in what you get, but it's not completely random. Panda has a wheel that she has set up in advance that has a number of different items on it. Uh, some of them are the items you can get inside the chud for redeeming uh, points right now. Other ones are more expensive. It's a gamble. Mm. Sorry, I lost my train of thought there. My dog started mm -hmm. barking like crazy while I was talking, and I was like, what's happening? And, and I she was is still barking. Aww. I will say that technically it is a sandbox NFT because it is yes. it's got the sandbox assets tag to it. However, um, there are my my sandbox NFTs, Alex's sandbox NFTs, um, and then there are sand sandbox NFTs. Mm -hmm. Spin the wheel! Nobody's redeemed it yet. I uh, somebody redeemed it on Friday, and when I think was it Friday we did it? No, Thursday last week. Somebody did it last week, or was it Monday? Somebody already did it. Somebody redeemed it not that long ago. I can look at the moderator logs. Somebody redeemed it three days ago on Monday. Somebody redeemed it on Monday. Spin the wheel. Spin the wheel. No, we can't because nobody can redeem it because there's a seven day cooldown on it. Yes, but. So you do cooldowns. Yes. I like it. Yeah. Lots of the NFTs have cooldowns on them. I think the only ones that don't is probably the Oak Wizard Staff and the Backpack of Tears don't have okay. cooldowns just because there's a large amount of them. Um, but they are only one one per person. So if... Um, who redeemed the Tears of Enemies? I am looking. I already... Uh, I believe it was Bert Z. Yeah. Okay. And Go West. So Bert Z and Go West um, have both redeemed the Tears of Enemies today, so they won't be able to redeem it again. And if they redeem it again in the future, they're not allowed to win it again. So they should probably not redeem it again. Because that would just be a waste of points. Yeah. Unless you want to waste your points, in which case, go ahead, lovelies. Go for it. Not Tears of Enemies backpack. The, tear, the backpack of Tears top up is the Tears of Enemies backpack. They're the same thing. I just switch the names all the time. A little bit like when we talk about the panda head in the jar. Light. I, Manovic, would like to know where can we view this wheel? Uh, 
it's when when somebody redeems it, I m create the wheel. Um, oh, okay. Because Alex that, over on Alex Kamisaze over on uh, Twitch, Twitter slash X. It's not Twitch. He's over on X right now, which is also Twitter. Is asking <laughs> so is Cyber Dragon's random wheel NFT not that thing? No. And I'm saying correct. Cyber Dragon's random wheel NFT is something different. His sounds like it's actually a random wheel NFT. Like it's an NFT that spins like the price is right. Yeah. And it's got a little little arrow on it and goes click, 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 you know. I will say as well, I, I did create one in Vox Edit, a random wheel. I just never finished it. But I assume it's it's like Cyber Dragon's one as well. Um but yeah, it's not it's not it's it's just the wheel of names. It's it's this. Wheel of names. It's it's wheel this Wheel of Infinity, turn, turn, turn. And it will look it will look like this. Hmm. Oh, oh, yeah, there we go. I don't know what That's happened. Your there. wheel of randomness. There we go. Um, it's a rabbits thing. I don't know. So it'll look like that. So there'll be a bunch of oak staff and panda heads, and then there'll be some higher ones. So like a, a Snoop Doggies, Shibuya, Shibuya 109, uh, Helgelina, panda, a Rabbids NFT. That's, well, oh, the OpenSea thing. The big wheel. Oh, yeah, yeah. So it's not that. It's not this. It's not this. It's not that. <laughs> That's Cyber Dragon's thing, I yeah. think. This is uh, we thing. did it extreme. It may have been Tuesday your time, depends where you are in the world, but we did this on um, on Monday. On Monday's Vox Edit stream, we don't did this. Don't listen to anything I say. I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> yes, you do. You're very knowledgeable. Right, who's the winner? Did we do the winner for the head? We did do the winner, and oh. I do know who it is. Congratulations oh. goes out to Garnikin. Woo! You have won yourself a normal panda head in the jar. Yeah. Don't be concerned. It may be labeled as normal, but it is anything but. Mm -hmm. Some would even oh. call it extraordinary. Aww. Enjoy, my friend. Oh, and go west. Which head did you want? Because you got dealer's choice. Oh, that's right. I didn't write that down. Go West, I have no idea what was given away yesterday. That was, oh, on our stream, that was, uh, there was a Dogami giveaway. Oh, the so. first one of the next head. Yes. I'm going to write that down. Sorry, you yes. carry on. That's why I didn't write anything down for this one is because it hasn't been done yet. It's the first choice of the next head. Yeah. There we go. Whew. I was about to say, I'm completely blanking and I didn't write this down and I never don't write things down, so I was very confused. Okay. Yes, yeah, so the dog and me things were the giveaways. Um, they're oh. special tickets. Uh, for the... to get to the final. You can actually go over to our Discord to find out a little bit more information about it because uh, there were 90 tickets being given away on Discord as well. So go check out Discord for that. How do I get over there? Here. I get over there from here. There's loads of little twists and turns and I like it because there's so much happening that it makes me want to explore, but it's not too crowded. Oh, whoops, a doozy. It is not too crowded. There's no cameras bumping into things. No. They've done a good job. They really have. I mean, it's a wide open space, but it's not too crowded. But at the same exact time, it's not vacant. You know, there's no point that you've been running around here where I'm like, well, this is a boring section. Every single spot you've been to, Ooh. you have something beautiful to look at. 
And not only that, but you also have a view of something else in the distance that's stunningly amazing as well. So it reminds me kind of like uh, Universal Studios tour. You know, you've always got something to catch your eye, something amazing to look at, something interesting to see. I need to go to Universal Studios. I've not been. It's it's one of those places where, I, I, you know, it's, I, I'm, I'm not going to go back anytime soon. Me and my wife went like four or five years ago and we had a lot of fun while we were there, but it wasn't like one of those things where like, I got to go back soon. Like I have a friend who has like season passes and he goes every year with his family. And while that's his thing and they love it, I respect that. I just, it's just not my cup of tea, you know? Yeah. I enjoy like new things, new experiences, but I will probably end up going back in another you know, probably 10 years. That's fair. You know where I really want to go? In Japan, they've got like a Mario Land kind of thing. I was like, mm -hmm. that that's where I want to go. I want to go to the Mario mm -hmm. Land. I've heard about that. That would be lovely. Hey, give me the password. It's uh, another regular here. He ha He's heard it. No, don't make me go on a wild goose chase. You. Tell me the password. Hey, dude, give me a beer. Do I know you? What Look. if he's not 21? He definitely is over tw Look at him. You you don't know that? He's... You'd be like Benjamin Button. He's like seven years old and you're going out to buy him beer. In which case, he has had a hard life and I think he deserves a beer. He does look a little knackered. Yeah. As a uh, Obia is building or has built a Dragon Ball theme park. That is I'm wonderful. In. I'm in. I really want to taste some sensu bean. I bet they're delicious. Ah! Another one, another person. I've got to give fish and chips to another person. Rude. Let me talk to you. I'll come talk to you in a minute. Oh, who's this? This is a normal person. Uh, okay, well, we have definitely gone over time. That's... I need a nap. And by you nap... You or the character does. Yes. Uh, and by nap, I mean I need to go play different games, <laughs> I guess. Your naps and my naps are very different. <laughs> I just, I just, the, or, or browse TikTok because that's kind of like a nap. Mm. That's a nap for your mind, just aimlessly scrolling. You're not really paying attention. So. It's kind of like a nap for Allowing the Allowing yourself to decompress mentally. That is yeah. very important for a healthy, functional mental state. Ah, it's so sweet that you think I have a healthy, functioning mental state. Yes, that is exactly <laughs> what I said. <laughs> yep, 100%. So does that mean we're ending the show for now? I, th I, th I think we probably should, yeah. I, th I think okay. we have reached a an ending Part. And I believe Sanzus is uh, about to is about to stream. He's live. He's, He's live. live. Oh well, yeah. then we're raiding the one, the only Sanzus. Everybody hype up, ready for Sanzus. Everybody hype up, ready for Sanzus. We're gonna raid Sanzus because Sanzus makes amazing masterpiece voxels. Go give love to Sanzus. La, 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 la. Bye, everyone. Thanks for stopping by. Bye. Bye. Bye.